Somebody got to do it. Yeah. If you ain't afraid to let your friend know you're going to be a light in this world, put a light up. Yeah. Cameraman, I hope you're getting that. And say this with me. I receive Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior of my life. I'm healed. I'm delivered. All is well. Nothing is broken. Nothing is missing. And if I die tonight, I know I'll be there with you in heaven. My name is Mason. It's been perfect with y'all tonight. And this right here is my evidence of what God had been showing me years ago. Like I told y'all when it comes to this music, I told you. A lot of these artists that y'all see, they are just prodigal sons and daughters who lost their way. One thing about the devil is he want to use people that have influence. So a lot of y'all big, the big artists and rappers, like the legend, they, they are, they hold heavy influence and the devil wanted to keep them up under his control. But a lot of that, that yoke around their neck is being broke off. This is evidence. When I was doing music, God had changed my direction. And I was asking God and seeking him for understanding, like, how am I going to do this music thing when the industry, you know, have its own evil ways? They didn't want to talk about God. They didn't want to promote anything positive. So God told me right then and there, he said, since they don't want to come to the church, we're going to bring it to them. I promise you that's what I heard. And that's why I keep telling y'all that same thing when God kept showing me about Jay-Z. He's a prodigal son as well. And the truth is, the devil that had a lot of us busy for many years. But this time, like this new season coming around with God raising up this new generation, we're going to be busy doing the Lord's work. You watch what I'm telling you. A lot of them platforms, like I keep telling y'all, God is going to tear them down and rebuild them. That's why I said a lot of artists, whatever you're doing, you get ready because you're coming up next. This is what God showed me when I was 24 years old. I'm telling you. Your time is coming. You know what I'm saying? You're going to, what did you do for God is going to last. That's why so many of us are on fire for the Lord. This is, this is not, this is just the beginning of it. It's going to be more artists like I told y'all before because that toxic stuff is played out. See, God allowed us to indulge in that type of stuff for many years because he said, okay, you're going to see that the wages of sin is death. And so after many years of indulging into this uh, negativity and it's, it's draining so many people's soul. That's why so many people are drained and don't know what to do. Your body is tired. Your mind is tired from all the things you've been consuming of the world. When you keep consuming things of the world is going to make you feel the way that you do this is why you have to this is why you got to stay in your word and get the and get what god has for us we got to stop eating from the table of satan and we got to eat with the kingdom of god because everything in this world is draining people this is why people losing their mind because we ain't been doing it but feeding ourselves all that uh toxic stuff including the movies including the uh, music including the relationships man that stuff is played out ain't no more baby boy and jody and yvette that is not the standard man you know what's his name money bag he had a he had an idea something of a classic but that don't need to be the standard that does not need to be the relationship goal they don't, they don't need to be that anymore. That type of stuff is going to be, that stuff is playing out. And God allowed us to get tired of it. He said, go ahead and indulge in it. You're going to be tired. All the chosen ones are up next. The one that carry the light of God. You understand what I'm saying? They're, you're up next. I'm telling you, them platforms going to be tore down. And your time is coming. All the many years that you had talent, you had gift, and you knew that God gave you something special, but you could never get it off the ground. Because I'm telling y'all, it was not our hour. Our hour is right now. It ain't getting ready to happen. It ain't about, it's, it's right now. A lot of them artists, that's why you're seeing them, you know, move away from the industry. They're starting to expose things about how dark it is because these are really uh, God's children who went out there in that world and got caught up. See, the devil gave them all that fast life, you know, uh, for many years, and they was caught up with all that entertainment. Come on now, entertainment. They was caught up in it. But after so long, they realized this is not feeding me. So now you're going to see them move back towards God. I'm telling you. Is happening right now. And what we should do as the body of Christ is keep praying for them to return back to Christ. No matter what we think they're doing, no matter what type of demonic things they're in, we need to pray that they come out so that they can catch this, so they can catch this ride. Because I'm telling you, God, it ain't going to be like y'all think it's going to be. At this point, 
you're going to have to choose sides. And I'm being straight up. That's even what I tell myself. You know what I'm saying? I make sure I keep myself in line. Because it ain't, I'm telling you, you're going to have to choose some sides now. You're going to have to. Ain't no more in-betweens, man. We done, you done in-between for too many years. God done showed you what it was. He done showed you, showed you what it's going to be. See, the devil just won't company when he go, or when he go uh, be cast into that lake of fire forever. He just won't company with him. And you don't want to be his company. You don't want to challenge God like that. God created this whole universe. Come on now. That's powerful. You know man ain't created this world. You can keep fooling yourself. You can keep reading all the books you want to read. But you've been here long enough to know man ain't created the world. They, we, we done came in the world and created things. But that should give you more evidence of God. Because our creativity, where you think it come from? God. We made his image. So when you have these scientists and people out here who are geniuses and they're smart, that attribute come from God, homie. It ain't. It don't take that much to figure that out. The only people that don't want to see that is because your heart is hard, you know, hardened towards God because you don't like God for whatever reason. But you better get that thing. Uh, uh you better get that thing. Uh, corrected, because God ain't the one you want to challenge. I'd rather be somebody, if I sin against God, I'd rather be the one to get on my knees and ask God for forgiveness and mercy than to try to act hard. Because you don't, you don't really want that fire. You really don't. So you can keep reading them books all you want to. The evidence of God is in your face. Ain't nothing to read. Like I, Listen, real talk, I'm just kicking it to you real. Playtime is over with. And that's why I tell me, I tell myself that I tell my, my siblings that playtime is over with. We don't, we don't advance too much. We don't advance too far in Christ to still keep playing. Like we don't know what's up with God. You know what I'm saying? The same way you be wanting people to choose sides, whether they ride with you or not. That's how God is. Ain't nothing different, homie. Ain't nothing different. When you say you want somebody that's really for you and ride for you, like all the way, that's what God talking about. You don't get to you don't get to keep going back and forth. You gonna have to really choose a side. It's really like that. It's really like that. I'm just giving you the message, man. But like I said, watch these platforms and watch how these artists change. And this is this is going to be the time. And this is the time where you catch on as well. And you make sure you you catch this ride. You don't want to ride to hell. I promise.